Fill her up. You're listening to the Gas Digital Network. Everybody listening to the thing is, I'm Shannon. Thanks for coming back to join us. Do you like ghosts and ghosts? Do you have fights and fights and? Do you have bad days and days and? Do you like ghosts and ghosts and? Ow, the thing is, ow, ow, the thing is, ow, ow, the thing is, ow, ow. Hey guys, this is Shannon. You're listening to The Thing Is. Thanks for coming back to join us. I'm here as always with hilarious comedian, my co- co-host, Mike Figs. What's up, Shannon? You stuttering a little bit because I'm, you need a little booze <laughs> in your system, I feel like mommy. I'm trying to figure out the order in which to put those words. I think you don't have to say hello. I think you should, depending on your mood. I, one day I want you to be like, with like this fucking asshole. piece, with this stupid yeah. ass. Okay. Yeah. I'm going to work on it. <laughs> <laughs> we are a stupid ass host, <laughs> co-host. Um, yes, yeah, so you, can, you can pour, please, Figs. Let's do it. Um, our guests already, they poured theirs already. They ignored us and they poured wild, for themselves. <laughs> I've had five shots already. <laughs> <laughs> They're going crazy in this warm weather. And so joining us from the, some of this is bad podcast. It's Colton Boom. Dowling and Dylan Carlino. Pop, pop, pop. Thank What's up, boys? What up? What's up? They're coming in, boys. Thank Brought Texas up to New York. You know? Yes. Um, I didn't expect you both to be so tall. Because mm-hmm. mm-hmm. I, I watched a few, I was watching a few of your episodes just to get a feel for you guys. And then I had an idea, but in person it's, it's very different. You're both very big yeah, boys. Like, sure, <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> yeah, kind of. yeah, you guys have a lot of Italians out here. Yeah, we do. So <laughs> about that, you know. There's not a lot of height in that. In that, not club. at all. No, a lot well, of spaghetti, but no. <laughs> well, a lot of meatballs, no spaghetti. <laughs> just fucking little fatties walking around. Yeah, you guys are two uh, fucking tall tan daddies. Both oh, of you guys. Thank, thank you so you much. So for much. That. I actually identify as boy, but no, I yeah. very sorry, sir. Uncle. <laughs> oh, very well. <laughs> <laughs> boy. <laughs> No relation. No, no, we don't do anything together. That'd be sick. That'd be disgusting. Yeah. Can you imagine? Should we call the episode Uncle Boy? Yeah, Is Boy that... Uncle. Boy Uncle, yeah. yeah. Okay. Some yeah. Who's hard? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nah, I'm rock hard. <laughs> I stay hard, my friend. Um, before we get into the segment, I do want to talk about, you guys were here yesterday, right? Mm-hmm. Did you? Did everybody see the eclipse? I don't no. care about it. Yeah, I didn't no? give a fuck. <laughs> yeah, I, was, I, was, I yeah. wish I did. I was on the plane. Okay, mm. so here's the thing. At first, I was like, I don't really care. I was a little bit bummed that we had a meeting kind of at the same time. And I was like, my aunt was like, oh, I got glasses. We should go by the boardwalk and look at it together. I was like, yeah, that's fine. We'll probably like drink and do Tell fun you things. Tell trash, boardwalk. <laughs> <fucking> Why <laughs> is the boardwalk port? trash? Boardwalks are trash. That's not true. It's a beautiful place. Which boardwalk? The exact yeah, the Hamptons? You're, the one you go gonna, to? Yeah, you're trash. Not, you're not going to you, know where I go to. Next to Harris? Or <laughs> <laughs> Golden Knight. <laughs> no, that's, different. that's different. That's what you're thinking of, oh, Jersey. Okay. Oh, sorry. Yeah. yeah, so what board? Oh, okay. Yeah, it's this beach Montauk? on Sun Island. Oh, okay. Oh, cute. It's fine. But anyway, I didn't get to do that. Okay. Um, but I, yeah. <laughs> All that build up from... No, because of the, the meeting and the timing didn't work out, but... As I was on my way home, I was on the bus, and then I was like in the financial district during like the peak, and I had my glasses in the bag, and uh, I was able to look up up at it, and it's like okay, that was cool to see. But what I loved was seeing groups of people outside. Everyone's like laughing, smiling. Groups of people together, like in schoolyards, outside of apartment buildings, hotels. And it warmed my heart because wow. it was like everyone's just enjoying this. No. Do you want to switch sides? I've never, I, I've never I, seen this side of you. I don't like that. I was, I, I, my mom works in New York City, so the first thing I did was go see her, and the eclipse was happening. And I hadn't seen her a couple of years, and she was in her a couple of months, and she was so excited to see me that immediately she started being like, "Don't look up, you're gonna ruin your eyes, Dylan." And it pissed me off so much that I was like, "Just get inside the fucking diner. I don't want to fucking hear you talk anymore." <laughs> All that drama just yeah, came back. Every, everybody was looking up and go, "Who the fuck cares about the eclipse? I need to get away from you." Yeah, yeah you have you two have something of problem with your brains because the eclipse was cool and Thank you. every time Whatever. i see it i'm like <laughs> we're so small the m- world does all your problems don't matter we're such a little like ants on a planet <laughs> and you know we just you need to love each other that's more. cool yes, yeah. Colton, yes that's uh, what i was just like, i might be autistic <laughs> no. no that's a good way to look at it though. i was that just thinking like so many people way. like are like conspiracy theorying about it and like talking so much nonsense about oh what could it mean and i saw what somebody could it mean what are they the fucking aztecs it's so stupid. <laughs> what are these <laughs> Tribes people you're talking it's to. Worse. <laughs> it's worse than that. I saw there were. I saw. I didn't read the article, but it was talking about um on the View. There was a woman that came on and was saying that um the eclipse and the earthquake that we just had was due to climate change. 
How could the eclipse be due oh, to what climate the change? View? I'm, I'm sure it's fine. I'm still air the view? <laughs> Everyone so on the show stupid. should be shot in the head. Okay? There's, there's like, <laughs> they happen all the fucking time. <laughs> how could what's ha- how could, oh, how though? They're trying to distract us from Diddy. Trust me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. This is all for, about P. Diddy. Is this mine? Yeah. In fact, yeah. when I was watching the eclipse, I was just listening to the soundboard from Diddy's house. Yeah, yeah. It, it was Take bad. That. It Take was that. real yeah. bad. Yes, bad Harrington. Boy. Bad boy for life. When that's I get the check. That's <laughs> that same view host uh, also said uh, her makeup artist while doing her makeup uh, during the earthquake threw up her hands, ran down the hall screaming, "Jesus is coming! The rapture is here!" <laughs> that's, that I believe. That yeah. I believe. <laughs> wow. Oh my god. You anyway, have so little faith. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus did say that. Anyway, I just thought it was like a sweet thing because everyone always hates each other. Everyone's always fighting in the yeah. streets and doing crazy shit. And it was just nice to see people happy that together. It was that sweet. Yeah. Any any injuries? Everyone was saying, "Don't look at, don't look up." But did anybody? It have was like... hard to not look up at it. By the way, yeah. like we were in the backyard here for a little bit and we had the glasses on. Yeah. Oh, but we would like take them off to talk and then keep going to like. Yeah. Look up at it. Maybe it was like, yeah, people are they they like they're assuming maybe. someone's so stupid they're just gonna like lock in and not fucking you know. Yeah, I, Trump did that. Yeah, I did. I got videos I, of Trump like. I think yeah. Lewis. I think Lewis yeah. also did that. I didn't watch it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, Lewis did it with his phone. He looked at his phone and he like zoomed in on okay. his phone right there. Yeah. Okay. But yeah. But there was a, well, we talked about it oh, real quick. But um, on Ross podcast we talked about it that there was one woman in 2017 that looked up at it and now she has like a permanent crescent in her vision Whoa, forever. That's wild. But how annoying must that be? That's kind of cool. Annoying. I hate it. No, can <laughs> you, you just imagine? say like that's this awesome. in front of your eye all day. <laughs> yeah, you can just like that's a shallow how moment. You know, you can start fucking ugly dudes and just like put yeah. the thing in front of their face. That's true. Yeah. Or if they have like uh, like ugly fa- ugly face, hot body. Because then you just don't see the face, just the uh-huh, body, yeah. if the crescent goes the right way. That's most men. Well, yeah, or the other way around. Yeah. yeah. That's true. Other <laughs> okay. way around. Women? Good. For- <laughs> <laughs> I don't understand what you're talking about. <laughs> okay, wait. What else do we have here? Oh, um, so the contest. Yeah. You don't even know what I'm talking about. Oh, the diet contest. Very good. Yeah, we got we to start <laughs> yes. that. Yeah. Yeah, so we've been discussing doing a crowdfunded weight loss competition between the two of us. I love that. Okay. I oh, love that. Are you back on board? Okay. Oh, I'm back on board. I used to be over 400 pounds. So I, I know. Oh, that. teach I me know. the ways. Oh, I will. I bet Nothing I, fits me. I, I just I, put this, this one from TJ Maxx. I literally have been on keto for the, for the past uh, almost 100 days. I have not broken it once. Wow. Yeah. And how do you feel? I feel incredible. Wow. I look disgusting, but I feel incredible. Now you look great. Oh, yeah. If you start with my shirt off, you'd kill yourself. But it, um, <laughs> it's all just like loose dead skin. skin. Oh, no, dude. <laughs> I'm going to become one of those like ripped guys on Instagram who was like abs and like the skin it's like anything's possible <laughs> <laughs> this is baloney flag yeah, yeah, yeah. Fucking... <laughs> oh no that's still that's all right man it's still good it's great what are you yeah. guys gonna do for your diets okay so here's the thing so first here's one part of it we're gonna make it crowdfunded sure. so the fans you know what we're gonna do we're gonna just make, we're gonna allow the fans to give us money you know we I love we do that, that right? no, if they want to contribute to this <laughs> wait wait what are they gonna to. buy you no, they don't have to buy us anything. We're gonna like uh, create. You ever heard of a diet where you make a wish list and people buy you stuff? <laughs> so, like, thongs. get with it. I get you guys get subscribed to my OnlyFans for free. <laughs> Is it still free? I thought you were switching it. I am, uh, you, have an only, you, have an, so, you have an OnlyFans? I do. It's ten bucks a month. Yeah. Okay, good, good. I have to warn you though. Apparently, I have to warn people now. I show little to no hole. But little. But that's a little hole is good. It's like yeah. the it's like the, the crescent eclipse. vision. Yeah. <laughs> Your asshole's the exactly. eclipse. Yeah. That was just him the whole time. Just like, <laughs> that was me. That was God's little hole you saw up there. <laughs> Dude, I looked right at it. Yeah, I'm subscribing. <laughs> um yeah. <laughs> so, no okay, so the plan is like create like a Venmo account and okay. then so whoever wants to contribute to it, they can. Yeah. I figure two month period is is like a fair amount of time. Okay. And then um the so, winner gets the pot? Yeah, the winner gets oh, the pot. And it's wow. is it based on number or percentage? I think percentage when are we gonna is do more away? fair. Um, so that that's up to you. Like I this morning, because I figured maybe this would be the start, so I weighed myself and I took a picture of it. So the date is there. And I no, took it at Shady, home. You no. gotta go full bikini. I'll go full bikini. I'm not doing that. And we gotta get on the scale. We got people want to contribute money. We gotta give. We gotta I'm give them a show. It. Shannon you can't be drinking water before to. What is no water? Numbers. You're yeah. right. I don't. I don't trust Figs' antics toes, to take his own pictures. You gotta do your toes pictures. nice. By the barefoot. way, he wants everything, and I understand you guys would probably be on his side. But everything I mention has to. He's he's just like Lewis in this way, the most annoying way possible, <laughs> where everything is, yeah, we'll do that as long as your feet are showing and you're naked. Yeah, I mean, what are we doing? We gotta give some for the it's fans, boys. You guys know what it is. That's not what this show is so annoying. I'll be fully naked. I don't care. 
<laughs> it's obnoxious. I'll be so naked. I'll do whatever the fans want me to do. I'm actually, and they don't want me to be naked. They're actually giving me clothes to put on. Yes, but they want you. <laughs> I am. I'm on your side. I would never take my shirt off for money. Thank you. I wouldn't even do it for sex. You should. You look good. <laughs> oh, you, I wouldn't get you haven't seen it. I have sex with my shirt on all the time. Wow. Do you go in a pool with a white tank top? No, I, I think that's wrong. I think, okay. if, I, I think if you wear your shirt in the pool, you're a pig. Okay, cool. <laughs> any kind of shirt. Any kind of, yeah, yeah, any kind of shirt. You're not a man. Um, oh okay, so that that's the plan. You know what I do? I go in a pool with the shirt on first, right? And then as, when I'm deep enough, I take the <laughs> shirt off in the water <laughs> and it float and I like... You know, like, hey, and it's his shoulders. So I'm just, I feel comfortable Wait, with his Wait, but do shoulders. you put it back on before you get out of the pool? Uh, it's, I've probably done it once, but no. Usually I'll just kind of like, all right, when I exit the pool, I'll be glossy at least. So I'll look better than the initial entrance. But then what do you do with the wet, the wet shirt? Oh, it's usually, you know, I'll Men just kinda, I'll, I'll kind of squeeze it, maybe put me the bacon <laughs> on it, it'd be cool, you know what I mean? But yeah, just a little sea line at this uh, point. So we need to do this diet. What are you going to do? I mean, I know what I can do to lose weight, but it's just going to be Is difficult. Is it going to be not eat? I, if I fast, the only ways I've lost weight are the worst ways. I have to fast, which is impossible because you're doing comedy at night. You're doing shows at night. I need to fast. Eight o'clock, don't eat. Start eating at 12 the next day. And I need to stop drinking. That's I probably, disagree. Those are my two things, man. I eat. I'm like, I've been doing keto. I do the keto bread. I'm making grilled cheeses at midnight after really? shows. Oh, I don't care. Oh, yeah. I eat. Let me tell you something. I quit drinking two years ago. I've eaten a pint of ice cream every single night. That's Whoa. over 800 pints of ice cream. The Halo like, one? The oh, healthy it's called one? Rebel. Okay. And I'll eat every single night. And I'll if I'm at comedy shows, I, I know H-E-B in Texas closes at 11. Yeah. I will leave shows early to go pick up my keto ice cream because I have to have it every single night. So I'm eating grilled cheeses and ice cream and still losing pounds, pounds, pounds. So you can do it. You, <sighs> I would just do that. That sounds like fun. It's My great. The thing is, I don't ever want to watch what I eat. Yeah. So I just do squats. Squats and, are good. And, and your muscle, your butt is your biggest muscle, and muscle burns more calories than anything. So if you want a big ass yeah. and a skinny waist, just, just do squats. Squatting. He's never dealt with weight. <laughs> <laughs> no. He has no idea Literally what he's talking never. about. <laughs> he came out of his mom's vagina with a pirate shirt. Yeah. This guy, <laughs> he's always been hot, this I, fucking guy. Yeah, I can't smell, so it also there's nothing there for me. Oh, really? Yeah. You can't smell? I can taste salty and spicy. Get the hell out of here. Yeah. And forever? Probably, <laughs> unless unless Jesus comes back, it's like I'm gonna do a couple miracles, no cancer, and cold can smoke. Okay, bye. <laughs> Next earthquake, maybe. Yeah, yeah, I need it. Wow. I because I was because I know some people like I got COVID and then like never got their smell mm -hmm. back. So I don't know if it was like something new or no, something. No, I had just five always... concussions, seven broken noses, and then I did cocaine for two years. So like, who knows? You sealed the deal. Mm -hmm. Okay, so wow. this is it. We're Sound gonna start like a, the man to me. I, I don't think there's a there's a scale here. And I don't want to wait another week to do it. Can we okay. just like? I'll take it at home. I'll do it tonight. Yeah. Or can you make your your wife take the picture of you doing it, sure. just so I see that Definitely. you're not like yeah, have just, a backpack full of weights. <laughs> shame me even more. Just have my girl. She no, we, we don't have me. to post. We don't. You don't even have to show me it. Just okay. like have it, so that we have it for the end. All right. Today. Starting today to die. Well, today. No, like today we're gonna mark our weights. All right. And then in two. What day is this? Eighth, ninth. Ninth. Okay. Is my that's my birthday in two months from today. And it's our birthday week. Oh, that's true. So that'll be the reveal. Okay. That right. works out. And then we'll have a big beach yes. party. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Where yeah. everyone can take their shirt off. Yeah. And we'll all be happy. Yeah. <laughs> I'll be walking in the beach with the shirt on. Mike, take it off. Yeah. yeah. Well, I am going to take it off. No, take it off before the water, Mike. <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh, last thing. Um, so on the, the exclusive Power Hour that will be airing on next Monday, we're going to play a game of bingo. With the guests on the show. Okay. And so the guests and... Do they oh, know the guests? Do they know the guests? I'm about to say it right now and I'm going to regret it. Because every time I say a guest before they come in, they cancel. Yeah. But I'm going to do it because it, we need to do it for this game. Sean Penn. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's Sean Penn. <laughs> so the guests are going to be Ralph Sutton and Big J Ogerson. Let's go. Um, so what I need from the fans, and if you can get some of these during the show, Harrington, from the chat... Um, Send in what you think would be good things to mark off on a bingo card. What are things that we all do? Me, Figs, uh, Ralph, and Big J. What are things that we all do or say often or whatever that we can mark off on the card? And then whoever wins, like, we'll get a thing okay. at the end. So cool. send that in as we go. and Because we're recording it this week. So you guys have to kind of send that. Soon. So you weighed yourself. How much do you weigh? I'm not going to say that. Oh, when do you say it? At the end. <laughs> oh, you're going to just send it to me so I know. No, I have it on my phone. So how, It's okay. dated. 
Okay, so at the end you'll show both. Yeah. Okay. I'm not going to say it now. You All can. Right. Okay. <laughs> I don't know about like 270, but okay. Yeah, but it's a guy. No one cares what that number gotcha. is. Okay. Actually, girls' numbers don't make sense to me. Same. Yeah, like, I don't like give a fuck you, how much you weigh. If you said 150, I wouldn't know if that was high or low. I mean, I prefer if a girl weighs 98 pounds, but that's <laughs> just me personally. I like, it, I like it thin, you know? Yeah. As a gay man who I, you know, obviously wants to make clothes one day that women can't fit into, I like you them small. You just want a, an yeah. American girl doll. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love <laughs> American girl dolls. So numbers don't mean anything if they're over 100. <laughs> yeah, yeah. disgusting. Because they're not worth anything. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys, before we go any further, we have to talk about Capsulite.com. If you are a fan of the show, you probably drink with us. We drink on the show. Oh, yeah. Or you're drinking with us during the power hour. A lot of drinking on the show. And the only way to get through the next day is with something that's going to help with how you feel the next day. And that is Capsulite. It prevents feeling awful the day after drinking. You take it during and before drinking. It's the most potent product on the market. It's doctor formulated. It supports your liver. And most people think that why you feel shitty from hangover is from dehydration, but it's not. The toxic byproduct of alcohol is the cause of symptoms of a hangover, not dehydration. And they come in little portable packets that you can take to a bar, a club, I gr- love those. A grinder date. A grinder date. You Anything. know me. I'm always on grinder. <laughs> yes. I love those little portable packets. I like to play a trick. A lady will think it's a condom, and I'm like, ha ha, it's not a condom. It's Capsulite. It's just going to make me feel better tomorrow, not you. Yeah, it's going to make <laughs> me feel better. But guess what? You're getting hepatitis C because I'm going in raw, Gross. but I'm going in with Capsulite. That's satire. <laughs> That's satire, he's saying, guys. <laughs> all right, so all you have to do to join us in feeling better the day after drinking is go to Capsulite.com. That's C-A-P-S-U-L-Y-T-E.com and use promo code GAS, G-A-S, at checkout, and you're going to get 30% off. I mean, that's almost 50% off. 50% right, right off, around the corner. Yeah, 50% off is almost 100% off. It's basically free. It's literally f- free. <laughs> yeah, it's not literally no, free. No, well, it's <laughs> almost free. Yeah. Virtually thirty percent off. Use code GAS G A S for thirty percent off. Come on, that's a that's a, a a steal. Get it. Try it out. See if you like it. It's delicious. One more time. Capsulite C A P S U L Y T E. Capsulite dot com. Use promo code GAS for thirty percent off at checkout. Let's get back into it. <laughs> All right. So that's it. Those are the things. So okay. send in your bingo thingamajiggies. Uh, we're gonna have a Venmo account ready next week for you guys to start donating to it and that's it that's all the housekeeping that we have to do now we can get into the segments so guys typically first time we have a new guest on the show uh we ask you to tell us a story about either your worst date experience or weirdest sexual experience okay well, we're both gay uh-huh. that's pretty weird <laughs> <Yes>. that's pretty <laughs> i mean i want to hear about these that's concussions pretty fucking weird <laughs> i played rugby so that's where i got those oh. Amazing. My weirdest date. I I'd say my uh, my first date with a man was bad because I was living with a Vietnamese family and I was like really like into pho and I was like I know all about pho. I have it all the time. And I went on this date with a guy and I was showing him that I wanted to like you put you break up all the stuff and you put it in and I was breaking up the jalapenos and I took a bite and it splashed right in my eye. But I had just been breaking up the jalapenos, so I fucking started oh, no. rubbing my eyes. And then I was like, oh fuck, oh fuck. And I ran to the bathroom. You thought you were talking <laughs> Vietnamese. <laughs> Oh, He's like, I don't think <laughs> you love spa. Oh, Should be away. pulling your eyes back like that. <laughs> they can <could> see us. <laughs> and so I went to the bathroom and I was like, trying to just like pour in the water on my eyes. He comes, he's like, "Are you okay?" Go, Get the fuck out of here. Oh so he played it cool. Yeah, and that guy had two pee holes. Whoa! What? Oh, that's a that's a little dicky has that right? Isn't that a? There's a scientific term for that, right? It's skin where it shouldn't be. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's just two pee holes. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. But what about um, the ejaculation part? Did that happen? Did you ever? Did you experience the yeah, ejaculation part? Yeah, but I never part? saw it. If that makes sense. Oh, wouldn't you just want to see it? <laughs> what do you mean? Wait, Where did it go? <laughs> Where did it go? That's Pay better. attention, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> I guess it would be hard to get right up in there at that moment. Maybe this is more to like watch it come out. Inside of me is my point. I, I get it. Okay, great. what I'm saying is, I do that. I'm horny and confused. Oh, it's not, really weird. I was like, it wasn't a yes, condom I issue, if that's what you're saying. <laughs> didn't, by the way, it didn't even enter my mind. Oh my God. It's <laughs> no. like when you get, you ever get like a little hair stuck in your pee hole and you pee oh. and it does the cross stream? Yeah, yeah that's so what I'm that, just yeah. curious what that would look like on the exit. 
Yeah, like, a, like, like a different feel. It's like that super around. soaker with two. <laughs> yeah, <bugs>. yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's just you know exactly. But then does it make it wide like, shot? Shoot out more like with your thumb over a hose. Like does it shoot out faster Ooh, or? I gotta try that. <laughs> hey, I'll never know. He likes Disney too much, so I stopped oh, talking to yeah, him. That's yeah, that's a big red flag. Yeah, yeah. big red flag. He yeah. was like, "Want to go to Disneyland?" I was like, "Not, nah, no, no, creeper." Do you yeah. want to go to Disneyland? What with your fucking two pee holes? I don't, <laughs> I don't, I don't think so, bitch. <laughs> Lord, you're peeing all over. Please. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Wait, how did how, how did you recover from screaming at him in the bathroom with burning face? Yeah, dude. And then result in like going back home with him, or was that not the same day? Well, um, I've never really had a problem with doing too much to. Sh- I've never been dumped. Okay. Obviously. Obviously. <laughs> yeah, so I think you. he still was like, mm, "It's gonna be fine." <laughs> <laughs> I don't think. Yeah, I don't. I For, don't know. I've never been in that situation. Forgiven. Yeah. That's Starting... cool, man. I, w- I wish I could be a powerful gay dude. You know what I mean? Like, this guy's got the world on his hands. Yeah. Got the whole Yeah, man. World. See, jalapenos <laughs> being racist in there. People don't care. <laughs> did you, did, yeah. I thought you were going to say that you touched the jalapenos and then you did something with his wang or your wang and you burned no, yourself. No, but the fr- I did do that to a girl once. I Whoa. was eating uh, spicy Indian food. But my dad's whole advice, like growing up, was like spit on it and don't yeah, go shoving it in there. So I remember, good like, dad. and yeah. she was like, "Ah, oh, fuck!" Oh. And I'm gay now. <laughs> <laughs> the Taki Masali made him gay. Yeah. Did oh you recover God. from that? I haven't eaten pussy since. No, but I mean that day. <laughs> were you able to like complete having sex that day? No, she was like, "We're done." Okay, and I was like, "I was like, I have blue balls, though, bitch." <laughs> <laughs> wow, deep inside every gay man is a little straight man still. Oh, you yeah. don't get your nut. <laughs> you just like, the, the. you look at yourself, you're selfish. Stupid you're bitch. selfish. <laughs> yeah. Was that the last chick that you were ever with? No, okay. over the pandemic, I did shrooms and Molly, and I uh, hooked up with a Australian man and his girlfriend. Nice. What they make you do? Actually, my husband couldn't stop blowing him, and so I basically I was I was on Molly, and I was like, her vagina feels exactly like a carpet. Nice. There you go. <laughs> wow. And I, you know, I did that, and then that was going well until my husband tried to DP her, and she didn't like that. Whoa. Wait, this is you guys are rock and roll. Wait, I'm confused. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm confused. This is your husband. Hmm. But you said an Australian guy and a chick, so it was the four of you. So you yeah. did like a little uh, Got it. Yeah. swinger stuff, or like I a guess so. Thing. Yeah, so three guys Not and a, a chick. Yeah, three yeah. Chick. I think if I was the chick, I'd be like, "What's going on?" <laughs> <laughs> this is well, the no. sick devil <laughs> shit. <laughs> These men all touching each other. If I was a girl, I'd be homophobic though. <laughs> she, the, whole, the whole idea was they were, went out drinking, and then they wanted the Australian guy to come fuck me, but. I just I like, that. <laughs> I, yeah, I didn't really want to be like served up in front of everybody. your husband and the wife. <laughs> yeah, it felt very much like go on, honey, you'll enjoy it. <laughs> He's like, I don't know if I like this. Oh, like, no. oh, so no. you're telling me you can't taste or smell? <laughs> if I was like, if I was a girl and my husband wanted to get blown by guys, I'd be like, you're a fucking. <laughs> <laughs> If I was a girl, like, yeah. if I was a girl, if I was a guy, I'd be like, "That's so cool." And I, yeah, and I was going like, "What? My pussy isn't good enough for you?" Yeah, yeah. Really, you need a man mouth. Mm-hmm. God, you're a so. You're mouth. just like your dad. You're so weak. <laughs> like, yeah. Oh my god. Wait, are all is the the Australian guy? <clears throat> did he participate with you guys at all? <clears throat> Base one. Okay, so two things. Basically, we were, it lights off at one moment, and he was like, "Why? Wait a minute, you guys. Or an or. Where's Chip? Who's and tagging then, my ass?" <laughs> at Chip. Or an or. <laughs> Wait, who's Chip? Chip? Chip's my husband. Okay. <laughs> Chip, come here. And then he goes, Owen, I'm sucking your dick. He goes, oh, wow, I didn't realize that was you. <laughs> and then he kind of like, kind of got in bed and then he was like trying to like help me help her. And he kept on like taking my, like, you know, you know, like in Ghost, how he's like, comes yeah. behind me. <laughs> he was trying to do that, but it was like way too hard. I was like, no, I don't want to touch it so hard. And he's like, no, she likes it. She can just be rough with it. And I was like, and I was like fucking jibber. <laughs> fucking give her a horror fucking do it. Fuck. Jibber. Jibber. Give her a good old fucking jib now. Oh my God. I never I liked how I unsexy this. the Australian yeah. accent is. I hate Australian. Oh no. <laughs> Who would have thought a mouth is a mouth? I couldn't tell the difference. Or, Sick. No. Coming, no. <laughs> so, so the lady got she got uh, airtight. 
Oh, well, d- did she get, was she airtight? Meaning there was mouth and vag and anal? Or was just DP in the vag? Oh, he was trying to DP vag. DP vag, okay. Does that wow. work? Well, she wasn't into it. So at this point, you're kind of, so at that point, you're, <laughs> he was trying to be like this. Like in two dicks, one Shanty? I don't have any dicks. I am a, I am a oh, celibate. But there is a story, Shane. I thought you were saying lesbian. <laughs> no, I go good for you, girl. <laughs> Fuck these yeah. men. Okay. <laughs> I'm just a fat little Mexican straight guy who's just like here for balance. <laughs> My wife. Are you really celibate? But you're yeah, being a I am celibate. How long? I, I'm an incel. Um, six, no. no, you're not incel. <laughs> six years. Oh, you haven't had sex in six years? Yeah, six years. I love that. You're like, and we need stories about your sex life. <laughs> yes, exactly. Yeah, yes, exactly. Yes. 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 She gets yeah. off. Tell me what it's like. Tell me what it's like. Are you waiting for something? Yes. A real man. Yes. Yeah. yeah. No, I'm Yeah. I'm, 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 I want a connection. Yeah. Right. And how are you getting that? I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> are, you, are you emotionally uh, closed off? Yes. Yes. Very same. much so. Oh, and so you're like, together. <laughs> I love that. You're like, until I connect, don't look at me. <laughs> <laughs> yes. oh, yeah. 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 Also, I probably won't connect. She's smoking hot under that hoodie. You're she gore- won't take no, it. No, I'm, I'm cocooning. And the face you're smoking oh, hot. Thank you. No, stop. I, I'm, stop it. No, <laughs> no you stop it. No. You stop. I Jenny, show love... everybody your feet. Show, your feet. show the guys your feet. Pull them out. Pull Stand them out. Up. Just those show them the package. <laughs> take the docks off. Let me see those feet. <laughs> I don't get feet is only for straight men, I, I think. Really? I don't yeah. think gay men and women, are, what, what woman is ever like? What about what, what about if, if, you, if your husband or, or your or gay partner, I don't know if you're married, they, the guy takes off his shoes. I've never been in love, but he, <laughs> takes, off, he takes off his shoes. And he's got beautiful manicure. I don't even nice know. I wouldn't even look I don't at even it. know what. Beautiful wow, you guys feet are straighter than me. Oh yeah, no. I can't. <laughs> Wait, you like male feet? No, I like my girls' feet. No, you like, I like men women's feet. feet. Shut up! I, got, I rub my uncle's I feet and it fucked me up. No, I like I, I like girl. I like women's feet. Yeah, and men. It's As okay. I'm doing every tick to show. I know you're gay. I'm like, okay. whoa, what are you talking about with my overcoat? And just so you know, we don't think it's gay to let other guys suck your dick. Yeah. Oh, cool. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys, just take a moment and talk about your freedom, and uh, we'll be right back. <laughs> Give me a minute, guys. Hold on. Uh, no, no, I, lo- I, I, I like the whole package. I love stockings, and it's crazy because I used to rub my uncle's feet. I used to rub my mom's feet, and I used to see my mom every morning with stockings on. So I have a crazy stockings, fishnet, heels, feet. Fetish. If this was Law and Order SVU, you'd be the killer. It's <laughs> hey man, I got like new strangling him out. <laughs> also, it's always like, oh, he's tied down. I like that you. Fuck. Hey, I like man. that you've done work on the find, figuring out about yourself. But I don't like how you're like. It's because my mom. Yeah, yeah. not yeah. the uncle. Yeah, exactly. Not, not, uncle. not no. the uncle. I don't even know why I mentioned him. <laughs> my uncles did do stockings too. Yeah, you know. They were more high pulled <laughs> socks, thick wool socks. Wait, which one's the uncle? You're the I'm uncle. Uncle. Uh, okay. uncle. Yeah. Very nice. I like yeah. that. Let's keep that in mind. Yeah. That's a wild, that's wild. <laughs> were they, were, are you a swinger? What does that mean? <laughs> what? I actually don't know that's what that your husband? means. No. no. Wait, who's your husband? Chip. 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 Okay. You're gay or bisexual? Thank you for asking. I <laughs> identify as bisexual online to trap men into hooking up with me, but nice. I am gay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck you. Yeah. Bisexual guys only want to hook up with each other, so you have to lie. What do you mean oh, swinger? Really? What does swinger mean? Swingers. You don't know what swingers are? Swingers I don't are... think that exists in gay. No. Gay swingers. is we're just allowed to do whatever we want. Okay. Yeah. All right. Um, no, <laughs> swingers, no, a swinger uh, a swingers are people that like meet up in a house and they all bang each other. Like, I don't go That's not to... what a swinger is. <laughs> 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 That's group sex. That's a group sex. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You fucking call you Airbnb. Yeah. You, know, you never been to a potluck. Yeah. Swingers is more like um, it's more like <laughs> two straight married couples. Yes. that are like we put the kids to bed. You want to come over and play? Yeah. It's like yeah. Sex. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yes. It's yes. gross. <laughs> I hate the word play. I hate oh, wow. that. Too. I know. Somebody sex. mentioned. I heard that recently in the podcast. It's a weird. I did too. I heard them talk about the sheets, like the plastic sheets called oh. play sheets. Yeah, it's creepy. I'd rather not so have gross. sex with you than have plastic sheets. So gross. Yeah. But I'd rather put our garbage bags down. <laughs> <laughs> Dexter. Yeah. Um, I had another. Oh, okay. Is it? Maybe this is just too general a question. But is, is there it gay? <laughs> 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 is it gay? Is it gay? Is it? Uh, are there not? Uh, uh, monogamous. Gay I've heard of them. Couples? They're losers, though. But they, but it's like it does exist. But there's also like gay Christians, and that's crazy <laughs> too. There's also like two different types of monogamous gay guys, which is like the really young ones that are like, I don't know why gay people all have to be open. And it's like, well, you're just 22 and you don't realize that you want to nut in other people. And then there are the <laughs> older guys who like escaped AIDS that are like, we did this because we we're so afraid of getting AIDS that like yeah. now it's like we are like we're together forever, you know. So oh, I think okay. it's like those two groups, and then we're here in the middle, just sucking and fucking. <laughs> Put it in. Rock and roll gaze. Yeah. Yeah. I need a new tattoo to say put it in. Do you yeah. get two tattoos yeah. here? We'll get you one. Skankfest. Yeah. 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 Oh, good. Yeah, we'll get you a tattoo. Okay. 
Uh, Dylan, we have to hear your story. So worst date or weirdest sexual Okay, experience. so I don't really date because I'm also emotionally closed off. But I do because <laughs> I used to be fat. I act out sexually on the apps a lot. And so I've put myself in a lot of crazy situations. Uh, and so one time I was messaging this guy on the app. My friend was visiting me from out of town. So I was like, oh, I should probably have sex before she gets here. So I don't like, ruin the trip. And so I went. I got on Grindr. And do you guys know how Grindr works? I've been trying to figure it out. I can explain it to you right now. <laughs> figure it out. So, because I'll tell you why real quick. It, it, on the SDR show on this network, uh, we're doing a bit where Jay and Ralph both have grinder pages. I'll show it to you after. I'll show you grinder. Okay. And then um and they're trying to see like who gets more matches. But then when I went no, on no there, no, like, yes, I realized like, that. No, no, no. no. So here, it's like, you, there's no it's listeners. just like messages. So it's like it's okay. who's close to you. Yeah. That's the And then it's just no messaging. Swiping. Just messaging. Oh, okay. So right? you can message any of these guys right here. I can these and all these guys are in the in the last and these are all under a thousand feet away so i can message any of them or whatever and they all have pictures or not pictures and so i was i was on grinder and i was looking and this guy popped up and he didn't have a face picture at all and his name was just bisexual so that already i'm That's in enough. I'm, I'm like i'm all, <laughs> yeah, I'm not like, like a, oh i'm like getting so excited operation it's like <laughs> someone's gonna kill you some crazy yeah, guy and that's what makes it so oh, fun yeah, I'm baby. Like, oh, yeah. here we go and so we're messaging and he's like now really... i know why you hate your mom dude <laughs> i love my mom <laughs> 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 um, <laughs> and so i um i he sends me a picture and it's just his like chest and i have a bad chest so him having a good one i was like here we go and a picture of his dick and i so and he was like, do you want to come suck my dick? And I was like, yeah. And so also I make guys send me um, voice memos before I come over because I want to hear the voice. You know, because it's like sometimes guys will be like. Because um, he's homophobic. He doesn't like gay boys. <laughs> oh. Well, sometimes they're like, I'm straight. which is like, And you're like, that's so hot. And then you get there and they're like, I don't know, are you going to suck my fucking dick? And you're like. <laughs> And you're like, oh, I thought yeah. we said, I thought we said DL. But, uh, <laughs> um, or you get there and they're like. And you're like, that's not DL. But, um, and oh so I, I got to this guy's apartment and I, mess, and I knocked on the door and he texted me instead of answering the door and said, enter. Oh, and I was shit. like, this is just like an apartment complex in Austin. <laughs> Wait, but do you love it more at this point? No, you now I'm a this. little scared because okay. I'm like, okay. normally they open the door and you can be like, because I, I also host at my apartment, but I like, and I've had to like kick guys out so many times because they like, whatever, you're like, you're fucking gross, get away from me. Yeah. And um, so I, and I opened the door. And I start walking in, and I can like start seeing. He's like sitting on his couch, and he, it just like all comes in. It's like it's like at first it's like oh you can see him in his boxers, wife beater. He's wearing a ski mask. Oh shit! No, and, this is good for him. Yeah, no, no, <laughs> I, no I'm, I'm, I'm locked in. I'm locked, locked in. It's locked. I, I, nice body. Oh. Ripped, oh, ripped in. body. So this guy, mask. this guy doesn't want to be. He's his identity. He doesn't want out. A hundred percent. So this and might so, be. Who knows? Who and this so is. I've never done. Might be Ryan like, Gosling. I, okay. That's what I'm thinking. I, I'm nervous. I'm nervous. You're like, he's black, but he might be right. He's black, but he might. He takes it off. It's Ken. Yeah. Wait, wait. So, but your initial, your feeling when you see this is excitement and not like you're terrified. I do want to say he's also playing 90s gay, like bop, bop, bop that's, music. That's on, like, uh, what is it? Like Genie uh, in a Bottle? No, who's the no, murderer? No, who's no. the murderer? <laughs> no, uh, like American side. No. Um, but Jeffrey thinking, Dahmer. You know what it like was? Jeffrey it was, Dahmer. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Yeah, and so but Jeffrey like, was mask off, open, very charming, meeting at the bar. I just imagine like, if he, if there were apps in that day and age, you would walk into this yeah. situation. Yeah, yeah. It yeah. was very like I was like, oh my god, I'm here. Yeah, I'm gonna do this, but <laughs> this is fucking scary. <laughs> um, and so obviously I'm like not a woman, so I went over and I like got on my knees. Uh, and you so, didn't even <laughs> greet him. You didn't say hi. You didn't change your no. channel. You what? just went right for. But he's wearing a ski mask. We don't want to yeah. say how you doing today. <laughs> 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 it's been a rough, I'm sure, a couple hours for him. Was the loot good at the burglary? <laughs> <laughs> Did you bring enough pirate gold? Oh, the getaway car. Um, and so I'm like sucking his dick or whatever. And it, great dick, great body, gorgeous. You can see gorgeous eyes. He's making uh, straight guy noises. He's like, yeah, yeah, for sure. The and then he I does just something love which that he loves his eyes through the ski mask. <laughs> well, the joke I say on stage, the, the joke I say on stage is like, I, I'm always like, you know, like everyone gets so nervous. I'm like, oh, don't get nervous for me. Like the eyes were cut out of the mask. I could tell he was kind. <laughs> and yeah, so, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah, those kind old. Those kind, I was like, <laughs> fake <laughs> contact. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and so I'm sucking his dick, and then of course, as all the straight bisexual guys end up doing, he reaches down to grab my dick. Cause that's what they're really there for. They really? they trick you over there to suck. 
suck their dick and then they want to suck yours. And you're like, ugh. Whatever. What a terrible trick. Oh, no. I'm going to get my <laughs> oh, dick no. sucked. You know yeah, what, man. though? You, uh, but when you're in no. the moment, you're like, I'm here to suck. Don't I suck gotcha. me. I got you. You know what I mean? I got you. I got you. And so I'm sucking his dick, and then he's like... <laughs> <laughs> I understand. I understand. <laughs> and so I'm doing it. And then he reaches down and he's like, Oh, you, he was like, Would you fuck me? Ooh. And my first thought is like, Straight guy ass. No. And, but then he, I do. And. <laughs> <laughs> I go, let's move into the bedroom. You know what I, I mean? I put my foot down and I said <laughs> no. no. And I fucked him. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and so we're fucking. He still has the ski mask on. I'm wearing a condom because I'm not, you know, disgusting. And so, I, sorry. And uh, <laughs> Colton, Colton doesn't hey, wear a condom. Colton will block the Australian people. guys. Take that rubber off, no, mate. He, if he won't wear one, if Colton has, he'll block people if they want him to wear a condom. But he's immune. I know. You know, yeah, you know he's <laughs> fucking guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah Nothing can He's invincible. There's a pill for that. <laughs> yeah. 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 And then so we're fucking, and in the middle of us fucking, he, this guy just goes like, he like looks at me in the eyes. He's like, oh my god, I don't even know your name. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> and I was, th I thought like. I haven't even seen your face yet. Yeah. <laughs> and you want to know, like, my name or whatever. And so he takes the mask off. Oh, shit. Hottest guy I'd ever had sex oh, with. My <laughs> <God>. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> I was like, I'm Dylan. <laughs> Dylan. Dylan. D Y L A N. Um, and then they got coffee. And then, no, we literally <laughs> had sex for. I actually had never had such a crazy good connection with someone. We had sex for like th on and off for like three and a half hours. Nice. Did they have a point where you're like, we're like making out? I'm like, I was like, do you like coffee? You want to get a movie sometime? Like, I literally was just fucking a guy in a ski mask and I'm trying to ask him out on a date. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I go, I'm clearly fucked in the fucking head. And we did that for like three hours and then, yeah, I fucked him a couple more times and he ghosted me. Who cares? Never fucked you. I don't do that. Oh, okay. Yeah. You're top. Bad body. Yeah. Gotcha. He will one day. Once I get a good body, I'm getting fucking <laughs> railed, but I'm not yet. Do you think that this guy... <laughs> That's a clip. Can we put that on YouTube? Now? Yeah, of course. And also... <laughs> I'll go on TikTok. I'll do well. I want to say this about the guy as well. Went, went to Harvard. Okay. Whoa. Do you think that this guy does this on mystery. purpose? No. Like, just to, like, have this fun reveal for other people? Like, he knows how good looking he is, and he's like, oh, they're going to be so terrified what I look like. Let me just do this fun thing where it's like, ta-da. No, I think beautiful. he's really into, like, anonymous play, but which he... is huge and gay. So do you think, like, he doesn't show himself to everybody? I don't think he does. I think he was special. I think he was like, whoa, this yeah, is very good. Yeah. We, thank you so much yeah. for saying I'm special. Well, that's what I was You're alluding special. to. I was alluding to that. <laughs> oh, yeah. I needed you to be more clear. I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, I don't think he showed. Yeah, for sure. I think he keeps the mask on yeah. all the time. Yeah. But he was really good looking. I actually think about him all the time. I'm like, should I text him right now? <laughs> <laughs> Why did it end? Um, I think he's clearly fucked up. And oh, so, okay. yeah. <laughs> that's great. <laughs> every couple of months, we'll, I'll get a text that he's like, did you ever want to go out on that date and I'll be like sure and then I'll never hear from him again uh, so I, sometimes I think he just likes to keep me on the line of like yes yeah. and so now I if he texts me anymore I mean he hasn't but if he did <laughs> I'm not gonna respond <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, but right. then he will. Yeah, 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 <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, if you text me right now, I'd be like, "And I guess did you know?" <laughs> location, location, location. Yeah, yeah. Know. Do you do you have a picture of his like face on yeah, your phone? Yeah, do you want to see it? I would love to see his face. <laughs> it's, just, it's just another ski mask. <laughs> <laughs> his eyes are so kind. <laughs> don't say his name because I'll actually, not. No, yeah, well, absolutely not. I actually Good don't know you. his name. I just know my ski mask. <laughs> By the way, I'm like, and now it's like embarrassing. I'm like, this guy's the hottest guy I ever had sex with. You see, and you're like. like <laughs> uh, I think that's so mean. Uh, that's... Of course not. I'm very excited. Good for you, man. Uh, so wow. you also don't have your name on the app? Oh, honey, no, no. I don't even have my face on the app. It's just a picture of my bre my gray sweatpants. I'm my all. Dick I'm on there. <laughs> I got my Instagram. I'm like, here are oh, my I shows. Know. I have no. Hell yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. That's wild. Yeah. Oh my gosh. All right. That's crazy. He we also. Have... Yeah. No. No. Wait. Wait. Go, what, go. what else? Yeah, uh, he also has this thing where he like. He loves sucking dick, and he has his, my, my apartment's it, called the suck shack. Exactly. Nice. And so he, he's kind of there a lot. And there's these guys, and he's like, he actually had said the other day, he's like, so there's like these guys whenever they're holding their phone, like I can't tell if they're filming. I'm like, they're definitely fucking filming. <gasps> oh, yeah. Well, I, they hold their phone in a weird way that I'm kind of like, are you watching porn or are you? Because either one's gonna hurt my feelings if you're watching porn or if you're filming me. Because it's yeah. like either yeah. way a violation. I had something similar happen one time. This is a hundred years ago, like before these kind of phones. A hundred years ago, <laughs> <laughs> just seven. <laughs> <laughs> it was a sidekick. <laughs> somebody was somebody <laughs> filled this. <laughs> like, Probably like yeah. where you at? <laughs> 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 <And> next time <laughs> oh, no. it's like fifteen 
years ago, probably. But um, so I was in this guy's house, and then um, we're in his bedroom, and then like here's the bed, and then in that back corner there was like a dresser that was open like this much. Yeah. And then I felt like the way that he was doing things, and maybe this is just the way he does things. I feel like it was very performative. The way that he was like positioning himself on top of me, the way he was doing things, it was very like what you'd see like in a magazine or something. Okay. Not even like a porn, just like weird. Good angles. Yes, yes, yeah. yes. And that was just like I couldn't get it out of my head. And then I was just like, let's just, I can't, sorry. And Did I, he I say just had anything? He was like, cut. <laughs> <laughs> Starts clapping twice. <laughs> <laughs> Did you cross your eyes and stick out your tongue at the same time? <laughs> like, take it from the top. <laughs> I had a, I had a similar. I don't know if it's similar, but I went over to a guy's office to suck his dick um, a little bit ago. And, oh, nice. Yeah, and, and that was the, it's like always bad when they're like sneaking you in in the middle of the day. I'm like, I don't have a lot going on, but <laughs> we are farmers. <laughs> <laughs> and I was sucking his dick, and I halfway through I was kind of like, well, we're doing this like right in front of his open laptop. I was like, this feels like maybe you know he's filming or whatever. Maybe that's not similar, but I was no, like, no, I yeah, think he's yeah. live streaming. Yeah. It. <laughs> mm -hmm. And there's no way to, you can't even like really. Ask, right? You can't. Oh, you well, oh, that's what we talked about. Got it. Because in my mind, I think like you can't. But the, all, you could, all you had to do was say, "Shut the door." <laughs> you know what my shut the door is? Is yeah. that they're gonna be like, if I'm like, what are you filming me? They're gonna be like, what filming your fat ugly ass? <laughs> like, that's like, oh. that's what I would think. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's what you think. I don't. Yeah, I think the same so thing. You that's guys, what I wouldn't ask. You, you guys need to stand up. I think we are insecure. You guys need to stand up for yourself. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You guys are like, hey, it's like. <laughs> They're like, what are we gonna make him stop? <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna are we gonna like, say no? I think there's a camera on the teddy bear. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. Yeah. I didn't sign a release, so you better not. <laughs> so he's about his money. He's yeah. about his business. Yeah. He's like, hold, 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 hold the yeah. fuck up. If you post that on your OnlyFans, I'm getting half. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be able to like recently uploaded on uh, uh, um, Pornhub with yeah. like me with my shirt on, bottom yeah. off. <laughs> 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 poo bear. Yeah, poo bearing, sucking dick, humiliating. <laughs> Who's this hot guinea pig sucking his guy up? <laughs> guinea pig titties. What the hell is going on over here? <laughs> guinea pig titties is so funny. <laughs> oh, <boy. laughs> All right, guys, we have to move on to the next segment. We are blowing through this time. And uh, I don't believe you, by the way. I know you, I know you look good on I'm wearing shirt. compression. Really? <laughs> like skims? Like True. Kardashian? <laughs> Skims. I'm like, a full leotard. If you took this off right now, I'd look like Kim Kardashian. I want that. I want that. No, I mean, have it over here. That's. A, I need one of those. No. And by the way, it looks it looks great. But yeah, I'm gonna get all the skin surgery, please. Wait, wait, wait. Can we, can I, 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 a picture. How big were you? Were you I like was fucking... over 400 pounds. Whoa, yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude. Show him the picture of me on stage. And my... what did you do to lose all the weight? Sorry, Shane. I started wait, going wait, to cross. Remember how we're running and... out of time? Oh, yeah. We'll, <laughs> we'll save it. We'll save it. We'll 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 hey. We'll you know how we did this whole thing already, and we're trying to move forward. I'm sorry. Okay, we're moving on to bad things. Bad things with you. This is Bad Things Part of Show. We talk about fight stories, physical altercations. If you've been in more than one, then the most memorable fight that you've been in. Whoever wants to start. Do you want to start? I used to play rugby and I was closeted, so I've been in many, many, many fights. My dad was also an airborne ranger, so he was always like, you got to hurt somebody for them <laughs> to learn a lesson. I think that's true. Yeah. I'm on board with um, that. Are you cool with him now? Huh? Are you guys cool? My dad? Yeah. 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 Okay. They have issues. Yeah, that's yeah. <laughs> Do I like my dad? Yes. Is it weird for me to say father and not be like, well. Yeah, I got you. Yeah. Uh, but he's great. Okay. He's very funny. We love him now. Okay. Um, Yeah, but I was just a closeted guy freshman year in college, and I didn't want to be in a frat, so I would just make a point to go to frat parties, blackout drunk, and fight them. But I also uh, was like somehow really good the drunker I got. Good. And uh, I remember just not being there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then my friend, uh, and I got kicked out of the party. It's kind of like one of those YouTube blackout, like, you know, uh, what is it called? Uh, Cloverfield, mm -hmm. where it's just like bouncing around. I'm kind of remember this girl yelling at me and then I'm being like, what the fuck? It's like a blackout then, scene in a movie, what you're describing. Exactly. <laughs> that's exactly. But that was, that's living in my memory. I go to my friend's house right across the street and I was like, they kicked me out of the fucking party, but I stole their bikes. <laughs> and he was like, fuck that. No one kicks my friend out of parties. So I was like, okay. So he goes back in and he's like, hey, what the fuck? And they, I'm just sitting outside and I'm 
I'm like, nice, he's taking care of business. This guy knows exactly what's up. He's like, I want to know who the fuck pushed my, and I was like, yeah, buddy. And I'm like, no, don't say buddy. <laughs> don't go in there fucking hot and be like, who pushed my buddy? I'm like, what are you fucking doing, dude? And so they immediately kick him out, and he just is standing at the door, and he just throws a brick into their window, oh, no. and the whole party fucking stops. And I'm just looking, I was like, this, like, 30 frat guys just come <laughs> pouring out of the fucking house. And I see, like, my other friend getting jumped. Apparently, he was getting in. Like, three guys just jump in. I kind of kick them. I turn around the corner, and three guys come after me. And I don't remember any of this, but my friend says I took one by the shirt, put my foot in his chest, and, like, rolled backwards and kicked him over. Whoa. And then, it was, and then like, kind of came up like this. And the other two went, uh, and ran away. Yeah, of course. <laughs> and I, I apparently, I just, like, I had bangs at the time. I just went... <laughs> I walked away later uh, to a boy's house. Did wow. anything happen? We made out. I love so that. So you kicked really? some ass. And then I took and names. You, and you took down some <laughs> fucking and then cock. I And then I tongued some dude. Yeah. <laughs> that guy that beat us up last night. <laughs> you, were like, you, you were like, don't say buddy, but I'm going to go make out with this guy. But don't ever He's say like, buddy again. That kicked my ass. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, well, okay. But that's a good move that you did, though. I know that move. Mm -hmm. I could picture the move. I liked Jet Li movies, and I think it just sunk into my brain. Yeah. And then Blackout Me was like, I got this. It's a shame that um, uh, camera phones probably weren't as much of a thing at the time, because this would have existed in infamy, oh. had that been the case. And yeah. now we just have to go by your friend's memory. Yeah. I wonder. Yeah. Who knows? Whatever. Fuck that guy too. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck everyone in that story. What was that? What uh? What area were you in? Where were you growing? Orange Where'd County. You... We went. I oh, went to County. Chapman in uh Orange County. Cool. Yep. Wow. Studied finance and business <laughs> and <laughs> German literature because wow. that'll come in handy. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Dylan. Um. So I was. I'm really new to having male friends. So a lot of my fighting growing up was with words with women, and so I really learned how to take women down and they, you know, mentally. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so I wouldn't say that they're like fist fights, but when you're looking at a girl and you're like, everybody hates your boyfriend. It's like, <laughs> <laughs> it's like you look like shit tonight. <laughs> it's like ro Roadhouse and then Mean Girls. A hundred percent. You're just, <laughs> like, <laughs> you're like with eyes. You're looking at your friend, being like, you'll never be anything. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. I, I learned, I've learned how to like destroy. You're not fooling anybody with that mascara a cunt. A hundred percent. Yeah. Like, deeper dig where it's like you're not smart. You, <laughs> women hate that. This skit was just on Family Guy. Was it? Yes, this exact thing that you're saying. That's they had. She's like you're stealing from Family <laughs> Guy. I'm like, okay, Actually, sure. then fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> Do it to her. <laughs> Where'd you get your hair done? Shannon, <laughs> those glasses. We know you're not smart. <laughs> like, I, 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 I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. She was very much like you're kind of like Meg. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Oh, I do have Meg nipples. We always say that. But, uh, you sound like Stewie. <laughs> it was it was Lois, and then like some like mom from the school, and they set it up just like a um, like Street Fighter, the game, the video game. Yeah. And so she would be like, um, "Oh, it's so nice how like you don't even try when you leave the house, like one of those things." Yeah. Oh yeah. And then, yeah. And then she then you see like her like life line go back and just like blow back. It was like exactly that's, yeah. that's exactly what it's like fighting with women. I will say that when I was like a junior in high school, me and my brother are like um, Irish twins or whatever, so we get less than a year apart. And I do remember at one point we were fighting about something, and for the first time, I like had enough courage to take the controller and like whip it at him, which is like really I, hurt him. that. Yeah, for sure. And I just remember it like hit his face and it hit him in the lip and it split his lip. And I'll never see, I've never seen someone more calm in his entire life. Like touch the blood, look at it, look at me. And we both were like silent for a second. And then it's like the minute I started running, he got up and it was like, I was like running up my basement stairs and I like felt a hand on my like, yeah. on the back of my like ankle. And it was like, pop, 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 pop. And he's like, I'll fucking kill you. Um, and then of course I was like, <laughs> we had a rule that was like only allowed to fight during commercials so like mm -hmm. i'd be like choking my brother out and he'd be like tied and we're like the, it was like back on fear factor he's like commercials are over, commercials are over. Like, tap out bitch yeah I love that both of your fight stories were so cinematic. Like, they're both straight out of a movie. What you said, he's like grabbing for your leg. It's all slow motion. Oh, yeah. It was scary. <laughs> yeah. So you've never been in a physical altercation. No, and now I have fake teeth, so I can't. <laughs> Why do you have fake teeth? Because poor. And so I, <laughs> so these three are fake right here. 
That's good. Yeah, it's a bridge, but they pop. I can feel. I actually right now I'm like I don't know if I'm smoking too much pot. And there's something like <laughs> I'm like I'm like is are they you know, loose? Are the they stuff? loose or is it our you know not my teeth? I'm always like, <laughs> do you have to like put a, like like a like a uh, glue? Like, oh, honey, they're cemented and but nice. they did fall out this past fall. <laughs> And we were, I was like, I was supposed to have a guy over to suck his dick, and I was like, I wonder if I can still get away with that. <laughs> oh, Because oh, yeah. well, the other two are shaved down like little, like little, like little dinosaur nips. teeth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Little like, nubs. Oh, yeah. it really looks bad now. You thought one bet missing was bad. Bro, you are broken, and I love it. <laughs> <laughs> it's a compression shirt, fake teeth. <laughs> I hate my mom. I'm my, so my, my, I hate my brother to remote. <laughs> sucking his ski mask on. I'm sucking dudes with no profile picture. Like, he's wild. He's a wild boy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh boy! Okay, <laughs> I, love, I love both of you. I love both of you guys <laughs> so much. Okay, last. We love you. You guys are great. You guys are great. Oh yeah, you gotta change my too. life. Change yeah, my life. <laughs> I'll be a personal trainer. Please, please. Yeah. and I will too. <laughs> Wait, you guys are both it. helping him in the competition? Oh, Help I can me. do your hair. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take it. <laughs> Was that a dick? Her lifeline just went down a little bit. No, I'll take it. You need help, bitch. You know what's funny? I, that actually, I forgot that it was weight loss. You know? and, I was, and, I, and I thought, what do women like? Oh, women like their hair done. And I thought, I can be helpful in some also, way. Also, they fat shape me. Oh. I get so excited. I was like, oh, you do oh, highlights yeah. and oh, yeah. curl and I, everything? My girlfriends Yay. in high school used to let me like, dye their hair. It was, I, yeah, crazy. I was very excited. I was, and I was like, I'm straight. Yeah, but... Uh, <laughs> I took it. I didn't take it insulted. I was like, wait, does he really do hair? I'm so excited. No, Cole someone does hair. I but... do do hair. Oh, really? Yeah, I went to hair school. Oh, but you didn't offer me the services. You're helping oh. fix. I feel because yeah. I'm kind of like a loyal person, okay. and I'll do his hair. Fine. Fine. And we'll do a whole competition. I'll get you, you in a slutty outfit, do. though. Fine. If you went shopping with me, I'd be like, let's get these tits out. I go, <laughs> yeah, yeah, we have to. Yeah. Okay, deal. So it's we're split. <laughs> we are split here. <laughs> My sister went wedding shopping once, and she was like, oh, I want like, a reception party dress. And I kept on just being like, you look homely. And she was like, Colton, you're not helping. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, do you going for poor, poor wench? <laughs> wow. <laughs> Okay, I have a couple of things. Okay. Um, in the booth, can I please have a water? Can you please uh, splash this? And then can I also have my charger from my bag in there? And then we can do scary things. Okay. I'll take a water too. That's good. This is Scary Things, the part of the show we talk about weird, creepy, unexplainable, possibly paranormal experiences. This could be any anything at all. It could be like sleep paralysis or like a dream that came true. From that all the way to like hearing a voice, seeing a disembodied spirit, anything that in the moment freaked you out and you couldn't explain. Okay. I didn't I prepared different stories. That's okay. That's okay. I'm like a gay vigilante and I've gotten <laughs> several people arrested. Oh, I like this. Oh. Thank you. Okay. So Austin's known for mass shootings on Sixth Street. Mm -hmm. This is the first. Uh, there's two, and okay. they're very short. Uh, the first one was there was a mass shooting. I was still doing cocaine at the time, and I was pack it, picking up a pack of cigarettes. I didn't know that the mass shooting just happened, um, but I was standing in line at this gas station, and I hear these two guys coming behind me, and they're they were kind of going like the, oh, bro, I didn't know we were about to be friends. Like, holy hell. How, like, it's very bro-y, very like, where are you from? And then they were like, yo, when I started shooting and I saw you pull your gun out, I thought you were going to start shooting at me. But then you started shooting over my shoulder and it was like that. He's like, dude, of course I was shooting with you. I heard what they said. And I was like, okay, I got to turn around and see who's talking. And I turn around and the guy spits on the gas station donuts. And I go, huh. Well, that I guess just another reason to not eat gas station donuts. Oh, I, I was thinking DNA right there, and we can find the guy that did the shooting. <laughs> Maybe they did. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe they did. And I go, and he goes, "What?" I go, "That's another reason to eat gas station donuts." <laughs> <laughs> you said it out loud. Oh, I said that oh, out loud. Okay. Oh my god! <laughs> and I just, I'm just, I just one pack of uh, camel <laughs> lights, please, <laughs> like that. I go, oh I call nine one one. They get arrested, and it was Whoa. them. Oh. Um. Wait a second. I don't Wait. call the police. That's crazy. Oh, I, I stay You're like, but me. <laughs> I do love when guys spit in my mouth. Oh, actually, okay. Wait, they caught them? You called them right away? So after that, you were able to leave and be like, these guys, I heard <laughs> no, them. Yeah, I was fucking terrified. 
I just the person who spits on gas station donuts it's is clearly the psycho. He's that's the crazy. crime he called in. <laughs> I mean, that's the thing that that's three perfectly my five Boston minute. cream donuts. He's asshole spit all over. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, the powdered sugar. Was, I was fucking wanting those. Yeah, 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 now yeah, I wasn't going to get the one behind. I don't know if there's a splash. <laughs> there might have been splash, sir. <laughs> We're coming right now. We're coming right away. Then South wow. by Southwest. There's a drive by shooting, a drive by uh, hit and run. I don't know if you guys heard about that, but um. It was 1 a.m. at the Creek in the Cave, and um, a block over, uh, two people were just walking, and a car smashed them. They Their bodies went a full block. That's how far they oh. went. And a, a foot fl- fell off. And I walked out. The police were just kind of like help helping them. <laughs> and I was like, you guys, we have cameras. Let's go. I'll show you them. And so I was just on the camera just watching this guy fucking get hit and die five times. And I was like. I got. I got to stop you. I'm not meant to see somebody die five times in the a row. The guy in a scooter. Is that the thing yeah. that that uh uh what's his name? Cam Patterson was talking about on Kill Tony <clears throat> last night. He said he saw a guy die in front of the creek in the cave on yeah, a scooter. He got hit that. by a car. Uh, black dude and a white dude, and the white dude's foot was like dismembered yeah. and all that shit. Whoa. Yeah, Whoa. yeah. So I had to watch that five times over and over. But the car drove past and we got them, and then he was arrested the next day. Holy Man, shit. You're- you're yeah. doing you're doing so much justice stuff. <laughs> oh, I know. One time I was taking uh, tasteful nudes in my in uh, again like one two no hole. So three. tasteful means no, no hole, no <laughs> hole. Very, or what about way? Very little hole. Well, little hole. No very hole. Little, no hole. No hole. This was this was four years ago. Okay. Some this way. was for like a jockstrap <laughs> Instagram story. Oh, okay. It's just very very normal stuff. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I got a notification. Hey, your car door's open. I was like, that's not right. I was doing cocaine at the time, and uh, so I go out there, and a guy was going through my car door, and so I was confident, very confident at the time. So I did the thing that you do when you like have a, a sibling going through your stuff. You kind of like run up and like stomp your feet behind him. Yeah, yeah. And then he turned around and like put a gun in my face, oh, my and God. I was still in my jock strap, so he had to be surprised. Just your jock strap. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh yeah. He was like, oh no, a hate crime. <laughs> oh, <wow. laughs> that might. Like, saved you for sure it did. <laughs> but then i was still on cocaine at the time so i thought that like maybe like you could i was like i caught you the rules are if i catch you you have to give me my stuff back <laughs> so i was like hey can i get my stuff back and then he was like if you don't get off away from my face in five seconds i'm gonna shoot you and i said what he said five four so i jumped behind a trash can because it was trash day <laughs> and he starts walking down the street and i call the cops and I'm like kind of going up out be- behind the uh, the trash cans, and he goes around the corner. So I like run around the corner, and he's just standing there. He goes pop, pop, pop. Oh, and so then I was like, fuck. And then the police heard the whole thing, and then they came and they got him. And um, they, I was still in my jock strap when they came. <laughs> <laughs> and then I was like, yo, you know, when you see cops, and you're like, why the fuck are these hillbillies wearing that? We didn't know we were going to be on cops, okay? Oh, were they hot, though? Were any of the cops hot? Oh, my God. So APD is like the hottest uh, <laughs> police force because they defunded the police in Austin. And then they realized that was a bad idea. So they had to hire a bunch of new ones. And, like, they hired only hot ones. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> nice. <laughs> so you were dressed for the occasion. Yeah, Did but that have, like, kid was only 16. Oh. No. Just, just jock strap. Kimono. Like, I don't know. Like, I, I like this a, sexy, like this is a sexy lady boy. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> don't style my photo shoots. Sorry. <laughs> I was doing manly stuff. Just, <laughs> that looks good. That looks really good. Is that um, scary? Wait, wait. I would have... <laughs> yeah, dude. I got this gun this thing. Actually, it's, it's bad things. It is, that, yeah, this, yeah. Is bad, this is bad things material, but I'll accept it. Um, did you press charges? That's interesting. I he ended up being sixteen. So you can press charges on a sixteen. Right, but I didn't want to like, <laughs> ruin this. Yes. I didn't want to ruin this kid's <laughs> life. He and shot I was like, his, bullets at yeah. You. His his night life isn't going in a great direction for sure. So I, they actually asked me and the district attorney. I was like, is there like a camp he can like a, uh, a scared straight a camp? camp. <laughs> 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 like, I was like, I was like, my thing is, I just don't want him coming around me. Anymore. We're gonna set camp? up bush gardens. <laughs> is, there, is there a camp where all the people who commit crime? So we could just put them into this camp. Yeah, and maybe they could do some work there. Yeah, and could, yeah I don't know. I was like, why I'm the hell do, does that, here. why does like justice have to fall on me? I, You're I killing it. You're doing it right I every time. All right, well, I'm calling the cops. I'm involving <laughs> the authorities. Yes. You've done it three times. Yeah. No, yeah. I've done it more, Successfully. but I have Successfully. taken too much of a different segment. Do they recognize you? Do they give you like a little badge or something? Like, good job, buddy. Are no, you a deputy? They normally, well, the guys when I was getting shot at, 
uh, the last story were like, this guy's clearly on coke. Oh, fuck. I, I was huh. like, so like, you guys like comedy? And actually one point, I was there for like 15, I was like, I was like, can I go put some clothes on? I was like, please, please do. Like, okay, okay, okay. Did you offer them free tickets to the creek? I did. <laughs> yeah. They did yeah. not take it. <laughs> Amazing. Oh, boy. Okay, so I'm assuming that because, I'm, I'm assuming that you um, explained this segment to Dylan. No, he's actually a witch, so I'm assuming he has something. He has the right stories. <laughs> okay, no, but here's the thing. So while he's telling his stories, I want you to just think it through. And just think about if there was something that in the moment was unexplainable and you couldn't figure out and we'll circle back. Okay. Do you have a story, Dylan? An unexplainable one. Well, I grew up in Massachusetts and so, and I do identify as a witch. I do a lot of witchcraft to further my career. Constantly, I'm in my apartment just like, <laughs> and it's, by the way, working out. So, uh... <laughs> Um, so I mean, I've had a lot of things. Oh, and, like, here's where you can help me. Yeah. You can do witchcraft to make me win the competition. That's for sure. Well, that's going to take hard work. Unfortunately, with witchcraft, <laughs> wait, they don't do weight. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, we don't do weight in the I witch love, community. I love the spirit be like, yeah. sorry, <laughs> like, we don't really like do that. It's kind of like uh, messing with the devil kind of thing. You know, yeah. you don't really want to. You want to do that. Um, wait, can the witchcraft do my hair? Uh, no, unfortunately, it's just, it's just as it looks like just my. Career. Career is working right. for. Um, it's not working for love either. But uh, if someone of a jacked guy walked in and was like, could a wish suck my dick? Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. Yes! <laughs> yeah. Ah! Uh, oh no, possessed. Best throw in Austin. Okay, uh, that's so embarrassing. Um, every th By the way, I'm always kind of like, don't go to the podcast, don't talk about sucking cock. And then immediately I get there and I'm like, guess he's cock goes sucking. It's so embarrassing. Bro. But, um, Okay, so I get. I mean, I did have a thing in high school because we spent a lot of times like up in the woods, and so we would do the things where you like drive up to the top of the mountain and you get to this one parking garage and you like flash your lights a bunch of times and it's supposed to be like a f whatever that would happen. Lady in white. Yes, usually, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Lady in white. You know, and so we would do that all the time. Um, but everything it feels like, and everything just turned out to be like probably explainable. One time we were up there and we, me and my friend, were convinced we saw a dead body. Um, but then it wasn't there. I guess the only thing I really have is uh, this one is kind of good. My dad used to tell us stories about the woods behind my grandmother's house and about like having to be really careful that there were spirits back there and like really scary stuff. And so then every year in Halloween, we would do my grandmother's back, like the whole neighborhood, and then we'd cut through the backwoods. And so every year he'd be like, you have to be careful in the backwoods. Um, you know, bad things happen here. Like what kind of bad things? You know, like spiritual stuff, like kids going missing. Spiritual. So my dad's like, <laughs> yeah. my dad's kidnapping, like, murderers. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Spiritual, you know, like rape. My, <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, my dad is, by the way, I should say, like a small town Massachusetts, like roofer, like grew up. He would tell us like insane stories. They used to like pick up hitchhikers and be like, have them in the car and be like, do you Kill know? What no, no, they'd literally be like, do you know what we're gonna do to you? <laughs> my dad would do that to the hitchhikers and oh like threaten and they'd be just crazy. Fuck with them. Like, just, just fuck fucking with kid. Uh, the big out of my car. Uh, uh, 100%. And my dad would be like, and Dylan, this is why you shouldn't do this. Because one time we got pulled over and the hitchhiker, the police pulled him out. He had a machete on him. Oh, we, were like, we were like, yeah, dad, that's a good learning lesson. <laughs> yeah. And so he'd always, <laughs> he'd always be telling like the backstories about the, um, the, the woods behind my grandmother's house. And so then it must have been like 2002. And like we're really young. He's like, all right, everyone stay close. You know, they, we're in the woods. And we'd all, it's the end of the night, we're all walking and we all start hearing something. And there's like, m people start running towards us like these masked men, and, like screaming and grabbing all the kids. And we're all screaming like, oh my God. <sighs> Ski masks? No. Okay. <laughs> and you're like, like I had full a, on like I don't Jason. Even know your name. I don't even know your name. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't even know your name. You're like full on Jason mouse. And one it, of them was running with stockings. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and bare feet. Bare yeah. Feet. Yeah. yeah. And Mom? It, it just turned out it just turned out to be my dad he had hired all of his drunk friends to come in the middle of the woods wow. to grab us and scare us in the middle. Of Halloween. Your dad seems like a great time. He's a, he's oh Brian, <laughs> he's that is kind of fucking oh, hilarious. He's the best. No, he's insane. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, how young were you at that time? I'm probably seven. <laughs> oh, <laughs> no. No. I Under was thinking 10. maybe teens. No, but, no, that's not. No, maybe no, that's no. traumatizing. I mean, that's that's the whole deal. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. I don't really believe in ghosts. I really anytime someone's like this place is haunted, I'll just be like, I'll throw out, you know, hey, I don't really 
deliver messages. So don't bring, don't bring them to me. <laughs> so if you think you have something to like relay, I won't tell that person. That doesn't Good. sound like a non-believer to me. <clears throat> what do you mean? You sound afraid like me. Like, I am afraid. Like, I'm not, I don't want it. Like get, I don't want to oh, see it. I don't want to do it. I'm not going to help you unless <laughs> yeah. you can help me. Close my eyes. All right. You're like, eh. Yeah. Anyway, I don't yeah. really believe in it. It but sounds I, yeah. like you believe in it. Well, I believe in Yeah, I guess I do. <laughs> yeah, do you have crystals and stuff? Different. Oh, yeah. What is that no. on your neck right now? Oh, this? I, I bought this at a witch store for good luck. It's working. Okay. Are you uh, serious? Yeah. Whoa, hell yeah. I, well, I haven't taken it off in months, yeah. What is a witch store? You know, like, where you buy like um, tarot cards and there's people doing like readings. And, like sage and, and, and stuff. And you can buy like stuff to do spells. And yeah, I'm always doing like Mexican witch candles in Austin. Just like they're all lit. I'm just like, oh, you know. And <laughs> that's what, doing a lot of spots. It's all working out. <laughs> it's just like you're not hosting your grinder dates. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's a weird yeah. place for yeah. them to Yeah, oh, it's so too. embarrassing when they come over to the apartment too. Because it's just like pictures of like pop stars on my walls. I'm like, oh, I thought you said you were bisexual. But um <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, I guess I don't have any ghost stories either. I'm so sorry. That's okay. No, that was a fun one. Okay. Were you able to think of one? It's okay if you didn't. It, I did, he forgot. but the thing <laughs> is, no, I do have holes in my brain. I, I, okay. So I also. I'm sorry. Can you just hand me that remote? I just need to make it a little cooler in here. I'm yeah, sorry. Sure. Sorry. Please continue, Colton. I apologize. It's totally fun. My dad did shit like that growing up. So like, whenever something scary was, it was always like, it's probably my dad fucking with us. Yeah, yeah. But we grew up like super christian like two times uh a week christian mm -hmm. and like my sister went to peru to help them somehow oh, what, kind, I, what kind of I, christian do you say uh it's we were an army so we switched every okay. time we moved <laughs> so i in pretty much was like well i but like well, mission, last, missionary last, types in england <laughs> missionary yeah. types okay um in fact she my sister married a, a missionary family from africa and, but uh, so cool, so cool. Thanks for helping. Wow. I was also like, which I love eating with my hands. Wow. <laughs> which Peruvian was like, thank you for bringing all these 10 year old white kids. <laughs> Wait, They're question. gonna be very helpful for our <laughs> fucking poverty. I mean, yeah. I have a question. Was she like dressed in native stuff and you were like, you look homely? <laughs> no, she that's wasn't dressed as Pocahontas. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> she wasn't doing face paint like, in Forever 21. I was like, that's eyeshadow, bitch. <laughs> uh, no, that wasn't happening. Okay. <laughs> but like, there's different times in like where I like bought into it. Like when she came back from Peru, she was like, I saw a girl get possessed. And like the whole village had to hold her down and they threw him off. And I was like, you saw they go. No, but they told me a story about it. And like I bought into it. And then one time I like convinced, I think I was just daydreaming, but I was like imagining that I was swirling. I was watching a lot of Avatar, the cartoon. And so I was imagining that I was like Aang. And Airbender, I was like this, Airbender. Airbender, yeah. Airbender yeah. yeah. And I told my pastor about it. He's like, well, you know, God definitely sends visions. And I, I can't say that I can... Uh, translate that one for you, bud. But uh, probably possessed. <laughs> yeah, I was like, "Am I a demon?" He's like, <laughs> yes. "You're probably gay. Yes. Probably gay. <laughs> is, is gay a demon? <laughs> it can be." Yes, it <laughs> Ted Haggard, fucking for real. I just saw a story earlier today. I was gonna bring it to a real ass podcast for them to try to make it funny, and then I decided against it because it's so terrible. But it was a three year old girl. It was a family. Do you know what I'm gonna say? No, oh. but already three year old girl yeah. like that. <laughs> it was a very religious family, and they thought she was possessed because in the middle of the night she would wake up and scream. So this little girl is just having nightmares, mm -hmm. and they were like, "Oh, she's possessed. We gotta get everyone on board to do an exorcism." And they brought her into the church, and over the course of two days. Did like terrible things to her, starved her. She was vomiting, all this stuff. And she was like, please no, I love you. Whatever she could do, do to like make them stop. And she died. Whoa. And this is like in the Where name of that? religion. I'm trying to think. It's hard to Sounds think. like some like think. Venezuelan shit or some they were, South America shit. Yes, it was something, it was something uh, Latinx. I don't yeah. know what the appropriate word is to say. No Wi-Fi. It was like, it was a, th I'm trying to think. I I'm sure, by the way, I'm email. sure the people who killed that kid are like, thank God she said Latinx. <laughs> 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 Thank God she's yes. re really being gender neutral with the, the <laughs> What an appropriate show. <laughs> That's our we daughter. Thank you for shouting out the candles. <laughs> <laughs> the candles, wait. They were.
work. On they work. <laughs> That's how you know I'm not possessed. <laughs> Doing the right thing. <laughs> it's, it's not in me. So it was like a, a th- I'm trying to think. Are you there, Harrington? Is he there? Is he looking it up? Oh, that's It was like a said. little girl killed by possession, I think. He was out of the room. We killed Skittles. We killed her. We killed her. We killed her. We killed her. I wonder if they were happy about that. I, my, that's just stuck in my memory. It's like one time this guy was possessed by pigs and so got uh, uh, pig demons. No, these demons. These, this is in the Bible. Yeah, this guy was possessed by like 300 demons. And so God was like, I got this. I'm going to put them in the pigs and kill them. <laughs> Remember? And all the pigs. Were like, <laughs> we killed them. We killed them. <laughs> <laughs> I just love that that was his fix. Don't worry, guys. I got this. I'm going to fucking murder your whole pig farm. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I wonder how they feel. About it. Have, is there any yeah, uh, follow-up from them? Is like, at least she, at least a demon's gone? Oh, it's in California. It's, it's, yeah, so it's basically that. Like, there has... Okay, so this happened, I think, two or, two or four years ago. It's either 2022 or 2020 that this happened, and they still haven't decided how they're going to prosecute or if they have enough evidence to prosecute. But according to the article, the mother said... <laughs> I love that. How would we even I fucking... I don't know, what do we do? <laughs> how do they, they murdered her, but how? The, <laughs> Who's fucking working the mom's like, can you guys charge the spirits? <laughs> have you guys done the spirits yet? Because I'm pretty sure they killed her. <laughs> the mother was basically like, we did the right thing. She mm-hmm. had a demon in her, like... What else do you want us to do? I feel like no one is denying what they did because they believe in it so much. But have you seen the videos? Of the exorcisms? Yeah, no. Uh, I saw a video of this little girl they were doing an exorcism on. She must have been like seven. And the, the pastor was like, give her back to us. And the little girl was like, no. I was like, oh, God. She really has to <laughs> kill that bitch. that bitch. She was like, she's, like, she's mine. I was like, oh, and this girl's like six. She's got something in her. I'll tell you that. <laughs> what she has is a fucking Oscar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Take that bitch to Hollywood. Yeah. I fucking love that shit. <laughs> <laughs> I want to see that movie. Teenage girls are very dramatic. She was like seven. Oh, All right. Yeah. yeah. Hey, but some... they're more mature. She looked yeah. like a little Dora the Explorer, like, no. <laughs> bangs. Why can't I have my backpack? When she had bangs. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God. I love that. Yeah. She flipped her bangs like you after the fight. <laughs> I'm going to go fucking mouth your... some boy. <laughs> I'm not your buddy. Um, so, do you not believe in anything? You don't believe in anything? Anything. Because of your upbringing, I'm assuming. You're like rebelling against it. Okay. Okay. Whoa. I think she just whoa, checked whoa. you, right? Hey, is that a, I still wait, is have that, sex, bitch. That's a read, right? Did she just read you? I had my hair, right? <laughs> <laughs> I have to get my hair done, I know. <laughs> uh, I don't, I guess I haven't found anything. I guess I, guess I believe in love and compassion. I, I like. I accept that. I'm not. By the way, <laughs> I no, know no. you're being funny. I'm not taking a dig. It's just that I think that like when people grow up with like intense religion, that you're just like that's such bullshit that yeah. I want to like not even think about it at all because it is like what's presented to you. So right. I, I, I mean, I guess anything is a very blanket term for I believe in whatever science can prove. Okay. So, so you think um, death lights out over? Yes. Oh, not me. Okay. What do you think? What do you think? <laughs> oh, I like. <laughs> I'm very, I'm very open. <laughs> You're I, so straight. You sound like a straight guy when you said you were like not me. <laughs> no, absolutely, absolutely not. Uh, for me, it's gonna have to. You're be. doing possessed I'm, girl voice. Yeah. <laughs> I believe in like I'm like psycho. I'm like past lives, and I believe in all that kind. Of, oh, you know what's unexplainable? This is so embarrassing. I did actually the first guy I ever fell in love with. I met him, and I was like, we've met before, and that was unexplainable. And to this day, I've always been like, oh, we've uh, this. It made me believe in past lives because I was like, this is not the first time I've met this person. We it, actually it had a witch crazy. on our show, and she told me I was his. Daughter. Daughter in a past life. Uncle? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> daughter. Daughter. <laughs> yeah. daughter in a past life. Yeah. He was my daughter in a past life. He was your daughter. Yeah. Wow. yeah. Wow. She also told me in a different life I was like a Chinese prince, but like a one that only died when he was like seven. She also told me that the ex I'm talking oh, like, about, Fuh. I used to be a witch and that she, he turned me in and I was burned to the stake. So I was like, I love this. <laughs> <laughs> and I, I actually have been to um, a bunch of psychics and one of them told me, she was like, <gasps> she like read my thing. She goes, You've had magic in all of your past lives. And she goes, but you don't have it in this one due to bad behavior with it in your last. And I was like, classic me. <laughs> <laughs> Let me guess. I, got, I, do? I can feel it. I can feel it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, can we ask some of, the, some of these things to the Magic 8-Ball? Yeah. yeah. I want you to ask um, about him being your daughter. 
in a past life. And then after, can we ask about my ex-boyfriend? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I say, I say, what is is Dylan? Was Dylan a, my daughter in a past life? Yeah. yeah. And just make sure it faces up completely, yeah, because it's stupid. As see, I as I see it, yes. <laughs> There's well, the proof right let me there. Try. Well, I'll try. I'll ask something. Spir- I'm gonna ask something spiritual okay. as well. Okay. Um, will my ex boyfriend ever love me again? <laughs> oh. <laughs> my reply is no. <laughs> <laughs> That's the end of the show, guys. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe. <laughs> oh, wait, I did this. No. <laughs> It's pretty accurate. It's pretty accurate. Have you ever seen that video? This girl, they would ask her, like, you can have dinner with anybody, dead or alive. She was like, like, anybody dead or alive. Like, my grandma. And she goes, like, yeah, she's like, probably my ex. I was like, I love that. That's crazy. Is it because we want to go back because we're better now? Yeah. Like, I think about, like, I my very first girlfriend, like, I wish I could go back because I'd probably, like, Bang her out better than I did. Bang right her now? out. That's yeah. what you go back for. Now we're out for the diet. <laughs> right now, even now, I, I was like 15. I didn't know what I was doing. Like now, I want to bang her now. That's what what cool. would you do? Like what moves would you bring to the table? <laughs> I would. I would just like wait till she came. I gotta make sure she <laughs> came first. Massaging feet. Massaging feet. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I would just. I would just. I would just. Yeah. I would just prepare mentally better for it. I would. Yeah. I would just get lubricant. Maybe you know. She was dry. She was a little dry. Well, she dead. You know what? You know, this is why. This is why. This is why. Fifteen year old dry. She didn't like it. She, she was like nineteen. You. I was fifteen. I mean, she <gasps> she didn't like me. She did not. You're oh, right. She raped you. She didn't she like me. She raped you. And, <laughs> yeah, that's actually, that well, is. She's that's not not okay. It is kind of. <laughs> it's kind of weird. <laughs> it's is weird. it okay yeah. if it's boy though? It's. Di- I really do think it's different. Yeah. She was like a skinny Cuban girl, and I was like a beefy fucking. You know, I was bigger than her. I was like fifteen turning sixteen, and she was eighteen turning nineteen. And you're like, she hey, was a I cheerleader. I was, yeah, I don't know. I, just I don't want to go my... back and just She was a cheerleader at 19. Bad. <laughs> yeah, 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 that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She was a senior. I was, whatever. I don't even remember. <laughs> the 19 year old cheerleader took my percentage. Yeah, the 19 year old senior just yeah. still being in high school. <laughs> you're like, I wish you could go back. She was and the bang best. Around. And you yeah. guys fucking respect her, man. <laughs> She's buying beer for the <laughs> I should just I, used to steal. I don't want to be with my ex. I just thought that would be funny to do to the eighth ball. Yeah, And cut that. And cut that. Got it. I'll lose it. <laughs> Leave all the other stuff yeah. in with the ski mask, oh, but cut that. Oh, 100%. <laughs> Leave everything else. Oh, but I feel like we can go forever with you guys. Oh, that's so sweet. You guys, you guys are awesome. But we have gone over a little bit, and I do think we have to do plugs and get out of here. Okay. So, Figs, what are you going to plug? Oh, man. Uh, at Comic Mike Figs. If you're watching now, the new episode of Fig Talk will premiere after this. Um, if you're in the city, come to the stand or the comic strip. This weekend, I'm at the comic strip. Next, I'm at the stand. Come on by uh, at Comic Mike Figs. Colton. I'm Colton Dowling. You can find me at Colton Dowling. I have a podcast called Some of This is Bad with Dylan Carlino. If you were looking for an OnlyFans with some hole, you're going to find yeah. me at Colton XXX Alexander oh, yeah. D. But you're going to find that link at my Instagram. Go there, Colton Dowling. It's Colton Dowling at Colton Dowling. I like your radio voice. <laughs> yeah. What's the, what's the handle on the Instagram? I mean, on the uh, uh, the OnlyFans. Oh. oh, I it's one of those Colton XXX. Fuck my whole. <laughs> nice. There you go. I don't know. What it nice. Is. Let them know. I think it's Colton Travels. Cool. Nice. Uh, at, at Dylan. You're, you're like, you didn't know it in a very, like, it's actually cool draft. Because the whole thing is like, who am I going to fuck next? I'm always on the road because I'm a road type. Yeah. I made it in a sad place. Yeah. I went to at home rehab last week. We're fine. Oh, we're we're never talked about that. Uh, we're doing vlogs. Uh, <laughs> if you guys need an at home rehab yeah. schedule, find my school at coltonstravels.com. <laughs> Um, at Dylan P. Carlino, you can follow the podcast at Some of This Is Bad. And if you're straight and want to show your dick, you can send it to my DMs. Nice. <laughs> Do that. Whoa. Do that, guys. Wait, you're not going to be a yuck yucks next week? He didn't want to give any plugs. He's like, no, nope, send that dick to the DMs. Yeah. So Shannon should be <laughs> No, thank you. Send them to Dylan. <laughs> thank you, but only if they're good. <laughs> Uh, follow me on Instagram at Shannon Lee 6982 wherever you listen to the show you can also watch it live every single Tuesday at 4pm Eastern at gasdigital.com slash live um, the best way to do that is to go to gasdigital.com use promo code TTI14 you're going to get a 14 day free trial which gives you access to every single episode of the show we've ever done as well as every single episode on the entire Gas Digital Network um, and every episode that we've ever done 
If you listen on iTunes, YouTube, make sure to rate, review, subscribe, tell a friend, leave a comment. Every little bit of interaction helps the show to grow. And then take part in the premiere every Thursday at 8 p.m. Eastern. And uh, Figs or I or both of us, we hang out in the chat and watch the premiere with you guys. If you have your own stories to submit for bad dates, bad things, or scary things, send it into the thing is podcast at gmail.com. And I think we have a couple of minutes before we leave. Do you guys have hard outs? Yeah. I want to hear about your at-home rehab. Oh. oh, after plugs? This is a PS <laughs> yes. moment? Yes. 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 Bonus content. Bonus content. Well, um, I've been to regular rehab, so I basically just couldn't go back there because it was like a it was like a Motel 8 kind of situation where like a lot of them were free people. Like they were like, I guess, homeless is the word. <laughs> <laughs> I like the name free, free people. people. <laughs> people. <laughs> not homeless, they're free. I love that. Not free people. people. <laughs> no, not all that wander along the streets are lost. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh. What, what was your drug of choice? Uh, cocaine and Bud Light. This last one, I thought I wasn't relapsing um, for six months because I wasn't doing cocaine. Um, and then I went to Pensacola Pride last year and I was like, uh, oh my God, I almost relapsed for a full year. Why am I saying six months? I know. Uh, <laughs> You're a liar. <laughs> it's because it was a slow roll. And then eventually I was drinking like, you know, vodka, you know, pints. When I was at the pints, I was like, all right, time to go to bed. So I just stayed at home and every time I would go like, hey, uh, they go like, hey, can you do a show tonight? I go, no, they're not letting me out of the house. And it would be my rule. But <laughs> it was basically like I, I was... People would want me to hang out and go, no, I'm sorry. My house manager said that I'm not ready yet. <laughs> That's good, though. That that shows, like, you okay, know, your so own you self-will. Yeah, yeah. And you pretended you were in rehab, but you were just controlling yourself. Exactly. Playing a lot of Fortnite. <laughs> That's cool. Because also... it's not for kids. <laughs> it's not just <laughs> for kids. <laughs> but also, like, the willpower in there, which I guess they say, like, willpower is not supposed to be the thing. But still, like, for you to be able to hold yourself back by mm -hmm. yourself, that's incredible. Well, I was saying I was quitting for about two weeks, three weeks, four, a month, maybe two, maybe six months the whole time. I mean, based yeah. on your and, time frame, I don't know what I can believe. And so I was just going like, I, I called it my 10,000 hours of quitting. You know how you have to get really good at, at one thing. And so it just became like, all right, we're going to, we're doing it now. Also, I just felt so annoying being the person like, don't worry, I'm going to quit. And it's like, at some point people are going to just you fucking do it You were also doing such a good job of hiding it. Yeah, my problem with way. my drinking like it didn't affect our podcast at all. And I was like, keep drinking. <laughs> my, yeah. my problem with drinking is I don't affect anybody except self, like self harm. Like mm -hmm. it's, I just get sad. I'm yeah. not like going and like breaking things. I'm not like, well, I was driving drunk, but I didn't have oh. any consequences. Gotcha. Oh. <laughs> okay. And how? So how long have you been sober for? It's April first. April first means what? Eight like, days. I don't know, nine days, eight days. Oh. You've just been sober for since April first. Yeah. Oh, don't oh. say just. It's, 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 <laughs> oh, that's a great the job. first One week. week is the <laughs> hardest. That's a baby. I know. <laughs> yeah. Good for, good for, okay, cool. <laughs> <laughs> I was, I was before, totally before that, it was two years, and then I was like, maybe I could do moderation, oh, and I found okay. out that it wasn't moderation. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Gotcha. Good mm -hmm. for you, man. Hey, I got. I guess you. I got three years on cocaine. Oh, that's good. That's okay, great. okay, that's good. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And I get tired a lot, which is exactly yeah. <laughs> exactly when I like to do it. <laughs> <laughs> and then with the so beer, that's what you would drink. Mm -hmm. Oh, but and then you said it escalated to vodka. Well, I like to day drink and like d drink a lot. Mm -hmm. um, so like it was Bud Light, so I could drink. I call it water beer, which is probably a problem. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> where, where you could drink it for eight hours yeah. and be. Call it vitamin, vitamin <laughs> water. Yeah. yeah, and then you know, just to go to bed, I'd have a little nightcap. <laughs> I mean, it sounds like it sounds just, have, yeah. it sounds fine. Yeah. <laughs> it sounds like you're doing great. You must have peed a lot. I I do. I drink about a gallon of water a day. Wow. And then Bud Light. Yeah. So, but did it start where like the first day that you're like, oh, I'm gonna try this, where you had like two beers. The next day you had four, and then six, and then eight, and then it, it escalated. Or the first day you drank, you. I drank it I said that I was gonna drink. When I drank. Okay. So the fir I went to Pensacola Pride and I did ecstasy and had sex on the beach mm -hmm. the first day I but that's what you gotta do. was doing moderation. <laughs> because doing you know, I was doing what I was doing you were when the, I was the doing The setting it. was not the right setting. Right. You know, you know what I mean? was the, it was if the you're trying to be sober. Setting. Yeah, yeah. To exactly. do all those bad, to do the things that you don't want to do. Yeah, of course. Right. But I was like, but all right, then I'll do it that. only when there's a special occasion. Of course. And yeah. you know what? I'm the kind of guy who likes to celebrate everything. Yeah. <laughs> I'm I like, we you. got home safe. Looks like nightcaps in my house. <laughs> right. You guys, another day and under the sun. You know? 
<laughs> woke up alive. You know, just turned into like a shitty saying on a cork board. <laughs> Live, laugh, drink. <laughs> yeah. And also, yeah, all those fucking wino sayings is like, I'd rather be drinking. Uh, I was like, me too, bitch. I also got into country music. <laughs> oh, boy. They, uh, they love to be like, oh, Jack and Whiskey is my best friend. <laughs> Colton likes off. getting fucked at the <laughs> other end. <laughs> Let yeah. me get my ski mask, buddy. <laughs> you can suck me off and drink a sad car. Not, not buddy, that's gay. <laughs> Sorry. <Yeah. laughs> Part of me. You can't yeah. say buddy. What's can't your say name so. there, friend? <laughs> I'm Latinx and I'm horny. <laughs> <laughs> I love country. I've been getting into country music too. I love yeah, country. but if you're trying to not, if you're trying to not drink, worst <laughs> yeah, fucking genre, yeah. worst genre. All the girls are going country. I like I like some country. I'm starting to get into it. It's just relaxed, you know. Yeah. Everything's quiet, you know. <laughs> no, <laughs> everything's quiet. Everything's it quiet, goes dark. No, nobody on speakerphone. You know, it's nice. I, like country music. <laughs> I don't know what that means. <laughs> <laughs> That's the show, guys. <laughs> <laughs> All right. It's weird to end it now because we normally end on plugs, but we no. <laughs> do have to leave. But thank you guys so much. You thank guys you have been amazing. What's the name of your podcast again? You guys Some are... of this is bad. Hell yeah. I got to check it out for sure. You guys are So much hilarious. fun. Thank I listened to a bunch of episodes today. Oh my God. You guys are great. So oh. much fun. I'm going to continue to. And you guys should also. So listen to their podcast. And uh, thank you guys for being here. Thank you guys for watching. We'll be back next week. Bye, thank guys. Thank you. Bye.